What up, man? It's your boy LB, man. And I'm here to give y'all the little quick rundown of who just got cut uh, for the Detroit Lions. It ain't going to be a long video because I just did a video yesterday. So I ain't going to make this video long. It's going to be real quick and sweet. Uh, let's start by... Uh, uh, saying that Joseph Fourier got cut. That was kind of a surprise to me. So they just got that one guy from the Patriots, right? Tight end. Uh, I like the big Joe, but he just don't fit with Cardinal, Car uh, Jim Caldwell knee right now. Uh, hopefully he get picked up by somebody else or he be on our practice squad. He got injured last year. He said something about he was chasing his dog in the house, and I don't believe that, but it's possible. I just don't believe it. And he really never seen to catch his rhythm. So he's been cut. George Wynn, weak ass, got cut. <laughs> he don't even deserve me to even talking that long about him because he sucked. He, he's, pretty, he's pretty bad. He, he's garbage. It, it, I, I mean, come on, man. I can do a better job at running back than George Wynn. For real. Uh, Greg Salas, I was at the game, the Bills game. He had a couple catches and then he just got injured. That's fucked up because he was doing this damn thing. Uh, especially against his former team, the Jets. He was doing this damn thing, and then he just kind of fell off the radar. He had a couple catches here and there, but he just fell off the radar. He had a couple catches in the Bills game, but he got injured. Hope you find a job somewhere else. Because I was looking at him when I was at the game, and he was just looking sad. Like He was just looking like, damn, fuck. That's some bullshit. I know I'm going to get cut because I didn't get injured. Larry Warren Webster, whatever his name is, defensive end, garbage. We dropped him last year in the fourth round. Mm -mm. Get off our team. He sucked bad. He sucked bad. Sucked bad. He can't get to the quarterback for shit. This guy, I mean, he just sucked. Um, Kellen Moore, third string quarterback. <sighs> I would have took him over Dan Olowski, real talk. Because Daniel Olowski, he's just kind of garbage to me. He's not like... He's garbage. If Matthew Stafford wants to get injured, we'll be fucked completely. Uh, I would take Tim Tebow over, uh, 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 what's his name? Daniel Lowski, for real, for real. But yeah, Kellen Moore got cut. I just feel like they probably cut at him because, like, last year they used, they kept him. This year they want to use his spot on some something else, like a Zach Zinner or something. Which I totally agree with. They need to cut Jeremy Ross, bitch ass. I hope they do. He's garbage. Uh, hope they keep T.J. Jones. I think he got upside. Uh, man beats Morris. Three one three hit man. Lions Nation, one love man. Thank y'all for subscribing to me, man. Leaving comments in my video. I feel special. <laughs> Uh, man, we, Morris, like I said, I'm a fan of you. Me and my girl get into it because I watch your videos all the time and she be wanting me to pay attention to her. But I can't, man. I'm su I'm such a sports fan, man, especially my hometown teams. Detroit Lions, Red Wings, Tigers, and the Pistons, man. I, I, I'm just Detroit all day. You know what I'm saying? Detroit all day. You see, I got it right here. I got the Detroit D on me and all that. Hold on. Hold on. Got the Lions logo on me and the Pistons logo on me. I don't know if y'all can see it, but I'm just a diehard fan, man. But uh, yeah, man, Beast Morris and Three One Three Hit, man. We should like pit a little. I know y'all. We already got a bunch of people that's doing this, but we should just get like one of these things online and we all connect and just vibe off each other and do. You know what I'm saying? Vibe off each other, analyze the game as it go on and shit, and talk about that. I think that'll be dope. Uh, three one three hit, man. Man, you funny, man. Your videos is ridiculous, crazy. I'm I'm learning how to do this shit. They pick sounds on my videos and stuff as I go. I'm learning. Like I said, I'm new to this. I used to uh do videos on my phone. I ain't know what the hell I was doing to be honest. Uh. But now I'm on my laptop. My laptop be messing up. That's why I'm gonna make this video short. Uh, hopefully they get rid of Jeremy Ross, man. They cut Tim Tebow from the Eagles. <laughs> They've been talking about him, Tom Brady, and RG3 for the past three weeks. Shit, making me mad, man. The Lions don't get no love on TV. They talking about the Patriots, the Cowboys, the Redskins, the Browns. They talk about them teams all the fucking time. They don't talk about the Lions, never. 
on TV. Unless Nate Burleson, unless Nate Burleson on TV, and he'll give us some shout outs. Other than that, shit, we ain't on TV. They ain't talking about us. They always down on us. Like we on 16 last year or something. We went on 16 last year, motherfucker. We was 11 and 5. <laughs> Better than a lot of the teams y'all talk about. Real talk. And two of them games would have been motherfucking 13 and 3 if we had on weak ass kickers. Real talk. But yeah, man, I ain't gonna make this long. Uh, follow me on Twitter because I'm gonna be pitting up the uh, players that got cut on my Twitter at the fourth sometime. Uh, Eastwarn underscore LB. That's my Twitter. IG King Eastwarn LB. Again, Twitter King Eastwarn. No, not King Eastwarn underscore LB. IG King Eastwarn LB. Leave a comment or something. I respond back to you and follow you back. That's it right now, man. Hopefully they get rid of uh, Ross weak ass because he can't do shit in the kick return game or he can't do shit as a receiver. He suck. That's what we got Theo Riddick for. Theo Riddick can do a better job than him, I believe. Uh, Lions going to rock this season. They don't show us no love, but we don't need no love from nobody. We're going to go out and earn our love, our respect, and our love because we Detroit. That's what we represent. We're a blue-collar city, and that's how it's going to be. And if y'all don't like us, fuck y'all. Y'all can suck dick. Uh, Mambi Morris, Ace Taker, the Ace Taker, 313 Hitman, Everything King. Let's get this shit rocking. Looking forward to watching you guys' videos as the weeks go on. Uh, like I say, man, I'm learning, man. I'm learning as I go, man. Yesterday I was up, last night before I went to bed, I was up trying to figure out how to put music on there. I kind of figured it out and stuff like that, so... Like I said, my videos will be better soon, you know what I'm saying? As long as I can talk, I don't really give a fuck if there's music on there or not, to be honest. Uh, I'm really from Detroit, from the east side, I'm from East Warren. Uh, really from East Warren. I don't stay in East Warren. That's where I'm really from. Uh, I stay in the birds right now, you know what I'm saying? I ain't got time for the hood. The hood crazy right now. I do go back to the hood to go get a little haircut. Because you know I ain't let nobody in the birds cut my damn hair and shit. But I do go back to the hood to get my haircut and shit. See family members and shit. But I'm in the birds. I'm living good. You know, right? you know what I'm saying? But the Detroit Lions. I'm going to do a video. Probably a few days. Just giving my prediction on that uh, Chargers game and shit. So I'm probably going to do another video talking about the weak ass Tigers. And they should fire the manager of Auspitus, whatever his damn name is, because he sucks. Our bullpen sucks. Our hitters can hit, but our bullpen garbage. Our pitchers is garbage. <sighs> but, yeah, them the cuts, man. Kellen Moore, George Wynn, Greg Salas, Joseph Foray, Larry Webster. It's more, it was more people that have been cut, but nobody care about them. They ain't going to make a team anyway. So, there should be more cuts coming soon. Cause they gotta have a cut uh, the rest of the the team down to th 53 by four o'clock. So I'll be seeing y'all in a few days talking about that, and I'll be posting it on my Twitter. So you guys go out and follow me, man. Once again, I appreciate the love from uh, 313 Hitman and Man Beast Morris, man. I appreciate it. Uh, we should go out on some uh on, on, on like on like some. Homeboy type shit, man. We should link up sometime, man. Out in the birds or something, man. Go out to dinner and eat and talk and shit, man. Chill, man. Ain't nothing wrong with that. We don't know each other and shit. We all strangers to each other and shit, but man, we all repping the same thing, man. It's all love this way, man. So fuck with me. Take each other's numbers down or something, you know what I'm saying? I shoot out my number, I shoot y'all number back when the game come on. We can talk, text each other, and you know what I'm saying? Shit like that, man. But I'm finna be on up out of here, man. Yeah, something real quick, man. Give me y'all a little update on who got cut and shit. Hopefully, Jeremy Ross all the time because he suck. But, man, I'm LB. You're watching my video. You know what I'm saying? Holla at your boy. I'm finna be gone. I'll see y'all in a few days. Hey.